Hello everyone, you are all welcome to Africa Media Live Television. Alleged land disputes, popular pastor Baba Shibioba accused of unlawful accusation of land in Abuja. In a contentious land dispute, Alaji Musbao Lamidi, known as MS Abuja, has accused Pastor Dr. SMO Mustafa JP, also known as Baba Shebioba, the owner of Incorporated Trustee of the Seed of Christ Golden Church, Land of Reality of unlawful acquiring a property without proper documentation. According to Alaji MS Abuja, the land located at plot MF1335 EXT 111B layout Kubwa Abuja was purchased in 2016 from one Godwin Danladi Busa representing Babana Ventures for 18 million naira with authentic papers obtained from the seller. However, when informed of encroachment on the property in the year 2022, Halaji Musbao Lamidi discovered a church foundation and security post built on the land upon his visit to Abuja. Despite reporting the issue to the authorities, including Upper Area Court at Harab Road, Kubua, Abuja, and the police, the situation escalated when Pastor Isaac Kelanko, who occupied the land, was arrested. Attempt to resolve the matter through legal channel faced obstacle, with the pastor allegedly refusing to produce relevant documents or disclose the person who sold the land to the church. Further investigation by the police and authentication through Abuja Geographical Information System confirmed Alaji Musbao Lamidi, as the legitimate owner, admits this development pastor, Dr. SMO Mustafa JP, popularly known as Babashi Bioba, retaliated by sending a court balafi to restrain Alaji Musbao Lamidi and law enforcement from pursuing the case. The case now scheduled for February 7, 2024, at the High Court 16 in Zuba, Abuja, awaits a conclusive decision. On the rightful ownership of the land, Alaji Musibao Lamidi, the sixth justice, asserting that Pastor Babashi Bioba actioned him to use status and influence to support an alleged wrongful act. Ewawo awon foroko nipa bi oloshe loni le ejoli ni tori pe Babashi Bioba fun ra re o n ye oju ko fe ki awon aya oran ki won gbe ohun ki won ya ohun amo gbo won se se magumago na to adajo ti sun ejo si ojo kewa osu keje 2024 iyen ninu odun justice lafe it is a criminal matter criminal case ile ti e n ko le fuwo yin ra ti e fe fiti pa ti pa gba E de pray ni irosho long. E de unko i ba yon lo ntele ni lo wo ni ege bi al koshi. E de ba yon lo ni le. A ni wujuba yon lo wo. E ni ti wa te wo wa ni le lo kote nte li wa te en folo wa. A ni wujuba yon lo. Ojo ke wa. O su keji ojo nta wa ni nwe. Ni adajo mada ejo. Lo magbe alifun alare. Tan se magbe alifun e bi fun e le bi o di ba kono a o tu ma rin ba e shi o da bo pass the judgment today in the court no judgment yet so what what are your chances with evidence so far in your hand well we are before the court and uh, incidentally when you are before the court you are not expected to prejudice the mind of the court so that is why i will not be seeing more because i am a party in this matter as a counsel so will you appeal after the judgment if it doesn't come we'll in your go favor? To the office first and look at all the options available to us. So do you think we should they should settle out out eh? of court? I said do you, do you think they can they should settle out? 
Out of course. It's something that we can say we propose, but instead of them to allow us to say to let my client recover so that we sit down and talk, they say no, they want him uh, arrayed by all means. And uh, if not for his health, we're not running away from this case because this is a very straightforward case that borders on title to land. There's nothing like trespass, there's nothing like cheating, there's nothing like forgery. So evidence will avail itself at the end of the day. That I guarantee everybody. Okay, can we meet you once again, sir? Yeah? Can we meet you once again, sir? I do know Eiji Bello. Right. Thank you very much, sir. Welcome. Have a nice day. My name is Dr. Johnson. You are the joint partner. Sir, what I'm can you say about the judgment in the court? The judgment? There's no judgment now. It's amendment of the... Uh, uh, of the, of the charge. Uh, so what are your chances with the evidence in your hand right now? The evidence? Ah, the charges are uh, very much. Because the claim uh, the applicant is doing well is in the, in the submission and prosecution also. Now, the defendants have nothing tangible to argue before the court. They were just appropriate and appropriate in one place. So definitely, if it by Thursday, 11th of July, 2024, when the matter is adjourned, uh, they are going to take their appeal and the, the amendment of new charges is going to be so perfect. So do you think we should, we should settle it out of court or what, what, what do you think? What are they going to settle out of court when they have about 15 or 12 count charges? So how do they want to settle out of court? I even had 20-something 20, 20 count charges. 20-something count charges. So, 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 Oh, what are they want to say to them? It's a, they are facing federal of Nigeria. It's a federal government case, it's not even individual. So, there are something to say to about. Okay. Thank you. Your, your, your name once again, sir. Pardon? My name is Dr. Johnson. Alright, thanks. Have a nice day, sir. Yeah, you